The House will soon consider legislation that would require accountants to blow the whistle on fraud they uncover in the course of routine corporate audits. First Business Correspondent Dan Cush has this report on legislation that could have a heavy impact on the accounting profession. The bill awaiting House floor action would codify and greatly expand the self-imposed standards of the accounting profession aimed at disclosing fraud. The legislation would require accountants to inform corporate officers of any illegal act they uncover in the course of an audit. Corporate officials would then be required to inform the Securities and Exchange Commission within one business day of any illegal act uncovered by accountants. The bill permits the SEC to seek civil fines against accountants who fail to comply. The bill's sponsor, Oregon Congressman Ron Wyden, says that 40 percent of the half a billion dollar savings and loan bailout crisis was caused by fraud, and that this legislation is badly needed. Well, what we've seen is again and again after the accountants issue a clean audit, one of these companies, an SNL firm, a health care firm, an insurance firm, uh, goes belly up. The United States Supreme Court said that accountants owe their primary responsibility to the public and to investors. And that's why I think that fraud ought to be reported. And it's especially important, given the fact that the financial uh, marketplace is so deregulated, to recognize that the auditors are the first line of defense. If you don't root out fraud there, then government and others have to play catch-up ball after a lot of people have been hurt. But former New York Congressman Joseph Diagardi, an accountant, says that the Wyden bill is not the answer to the problem. Well, I think it's a bad idea because, in effect, what you're doing is you're making the accounting profession a, a policeman or a watchdog now for these governmental agencies. And if nothing else, it will undermine the professional trust uh, between the, the clients and, and the accounting firms, the accounting profession. Uh, it seems to me that it's, it's a bad idea, and what we ought to do is continue to rely on the accounting profession to come up with the solution, and they've done it so well over the past hundred years, uh, let them go on and do that. In spite of some opposition, the accounting whistleblower bill has a good chance of passing both the House and the Senate before Congress adjourns in October. Dan Cush, First Business.